Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I am going to show how you can install and run Adobe Acrobat software in your Android with using Exegir Windows Emulator application. So let's get into the video. So in this video, I am going to show how you can install and run Adobe Abrocat software in your Android with using Exegir Windows Emulator application. So basically, Adobe Abrocat is a PDF viewer or reading software, which in that software, you can view any PDF file. So basically, this is the uh, PC software. But in this video, I am going to show how you can install it in your Android phone. So it's normal to view any PDF file in Android phone. There are a lot of application over it. So the main motto of my channel is to show how you can install any PC software in your Android. So there are some other uh, many purposes to install that software in Android. Of videos on my channel that I have shown how you can install PC software in Android. All the different different softwares I have shown. So we don't know which software required by which person. So I am going to show every single software which is going to run in android while using emulator application so i just not show how you can install but i also show how how we can use it and how it's working perfectly working so every single software going to perfectly work so don't think that if it is emulator it will work or not it will going to work or not in my video every single software which i've shown is perfectly working you can check it uh, before making video i tested it a lot and then i make a video for you to make it easy to read why am i making video on P installing pc software and android means a lot of people in this world don't have pc they can't afford pc or for some reasons they don't have pc in any situation they need pc software to run in their android perfectly which is working so my motto is to show them the installing pc software in android possible with this method so now let's get back to the video so to install adobe abrocut pc software in your android so you need to install an application called exegir windows emulator application so basically this is the uh, emulator application for android and there are a lot of lot of videos on my channel that i have uh, shown and using from since very long time i'm using this application i'm making videos with this application recently there is an another application launch which name is been later i've also covered that video there are a lot of videos on my channel you can check out my channel and i have made a separate drill video of how you can install uh, android exegir windows emulator application in your android you can check out my channel so after downloading and installing exegir windows emulator application in your android phone you need to download and a file the adobe abrocat application so this is the software and i'm going to provide the link download link of it in the description and i also going to provide the link of the exegir windows emulator application you don't need to worry about it so i'm not going to provide directly link of this softwares because uh, in youtube going to delete it uh, so uh, i'm going to provide the link of my telegram channel in my telegram channel i have uploaded a lot of links uh, which from where you can download all the files which i am showing the software the os so there are a lot of uh, uh, links available on my telegram channel make sure you download the telegram application and you can access all the links from there so you have installed the exegir windows emulator application i have downloaded the uh, adobe abrocat software so make sure it will be in the download folder of your android internal storage so this is my android internal storage and this is the download folder make sure the software is in it so you can access it in from your exegir windows emulator application so now i'm going to open the exegir windows emulator application in my previous video, I've installed PowerPoint software, so that's why it's showing here desktop. So you have to click on the three lines, you have to click on the manage containers, you have to click on these three dots, and you have to click on the run explorer. So it will saying starting up launching. So it will going to start the application. So as you can see, it will be in the landscape mode. So let me just turn the Android phone. So as you can see, this is the Exegir or uh, desktop. So let me just set up the camera. So as you can see just now I've uh, set up the camera and as you can see this is the desktop of the Exegir Windows emulator application. After clicking run explorer so it will open the file manager of this application. So you remember that I have said that after downloading 
software you have to keep it in the download folder of your android internal storage because the exagear will going to access the android internal storage only the download folder of your android internal storage so as you can see this is the d drive of the exagear file manager and it will access all the files of my android internal storage as you can see the software adobe acrobat so now i'm going to long press on it and just going to click on the open after clicking open it will saying this uh, this will install adobe acrobat reader 3.0.1 do you wish to install so as i already mentioned this is the adobe acrobat reader software so this software is used to view any pdf file so let me just click to yes the reason why i'm showing uh, the pdf reader software because uh, I'm going to make my Android phone into PC so in Exegate there is no file to view any PDF file so let me just uh, show you so as you can see this is the uh, file manager and I have installed I have downloaded the PDF file and it I can't view so as you can see there is no uh, software to view this so I'm going to install this Adobe software to view that uh, PDF view file so as you can see it will installing So as you can see the software has been installed Adobe Acrobat 3.0.1 setup so let me just click to next so now let me just click to yes so you have to follow all the procedure which I am showing in this video if you are getting a problem let me know in the comments I try to fix your problem so let me click to next so as you can see it will sync decomposing Adobe files into C drive so the software is decomposing The installation process is only for once you did not require to install again and again so keep this in mind if you're thinking i uh, you have to install it again and again you don't need to install it once you install it in your exegate so it will always uh, remain in your application only you can access it at any time while opening the exegate application and the exegate will going to take your android internal storage so make sure that you have a lot of storage over in your android phone so the software has been successfully installed so let me just uncheck this uh, readme files and just click to finish so it will saying setup is complete thank you for choosing so let me just uh, close the application and now i'm going to open the file manager so before i said i have downloaded the pdf file to view but it doesn't it's not going to open because exactly don't have any uh, pre-installed pdf software to view any pdf file so just now i've installed the adobe software adobe acrobat now i'm going to open the software so as you can see there is a start button over here same like the windows so let me just click to start button and click to program so as you can see the adobe acrobat software has been appeared in the program let me just click on it and i'm going to click on the uh, acrobat reader 3.0.1 so as you can see this is the software has been opened here so as you can see this is the software acrobat reader now i am going to open any pdf file before uh, i can't open any pdf file because there is no software in the exagir to view any pdf so i have installed the acrobat reader software and i am going to click on the files and just click to open so it will so this is the acrobat pdf so let me go in, let me just open this file to view whether the pdf viewer software is working or not so this is the pdf file i am going to just click to unopen so as you can see the pdf file has been opened here you can view this pdf file so as you can see this is the pdf file you can view and there are a lot of features over in this application while you can change this next page as you can see like this you can find out any word in this pdf and you can zoom in this pdf like this and you can uh, move So as you can see this is the features of this uh, uh, software there are a lot of benefits of it 
so I can select uh, select all and I can copy from the PDF so just now I have copy and I can paste it any software so in my upcoming video I try to show how you can use any software which required any text pasting uh, process so you can view any file PDF file and you can copy text from it and you can paste it in the software so it will be very useful for you if you are using Adobe Photoshop application and if you want to paste any text from any PDF you can view any PDF file in this Acrobat software and you can select it and copy it and you can paste it in the photoshop so in my previous video i've already shown how you can install and then adobe photoshop software in your android you can check out my previous video so this is the software you can uh, install in your android while using executor pc emulator application so as you can see this is the acrobat reader application by adobe has been successfully installed and perfectly running in my android phone and i can view any pdf file and i can select it the text from this pdf file and i can copy it and i can paste it in any software so as you can see this is the adobe acrobat reader software has been so perfectly working in android so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have any question or problem, let me know in the comments. Thank you.